A centre of excellence in cancer care, but not enough nurses to do the caring. A leaked memo from the head of chemotherapy here at the Churchill Hospital in Oxford proposes delaying and rationing. The trust insists the leaked memo was an internal discussion document. Patients are not going to have their treatment cancelled and they're not going to have it unduly delayed. So they're all going to have chemotherapy treatment in our day unit within the national cancer waiting time target. And there's no rationing at there's the moment, but is it being discussed? There's absolutely no rationing. All we're doing is we're reviewing within the consultant body that we're giving the best treatment for patients. And that may be that giving fewer treatments is actually as good as giving more treatments. It's estimated there are 40,000 nursing vacancies across the country. And although the government has announced 5,000 extra training places, the unions and patients groups say it's too little, too late. This is a bit of a shot across the bows, I think, um, for the powers that be that control the budgets and help with the, the staffing levels of units such as this here. Um, it is not the fault of the clinicians. They are literally crying for help. The government says there are record levels of NHS funding and cites the new cancer workforce strategy. No change here yet, but today's revelation is a glimpse of the day-to-day -day struggles on the wards of every hospital. Simon Viger, 5 News, Oxford.